everybody! Today, me and the Yapi will be reading a story. But I'm warning you, there is no dragon in the story, okay? So, let's begin! There is no dragon in this story. And please don't look at this. He's not here, okay? By Yo Carter and Deborah are right. This was supposed to be a story about a dragon. Who captured a princess? Oh no! When scream, a young came a knight. Yeah, who fought with the dragon? Gasp! Rescued the princess. Hurrah! The end. However, I can't tell you that story because dragon has gone off in a half. I will not capture any icky froggy princesses today, and I say not fight any more brave shiny knights. I'm going to a story where I can be a hero for a change. So you see, Yuri Dragon is in a very bad mood, of course. Since a cute Yuri Dragon is tired of being a villain. Hello, can I be in your story? I got save you from that fox. No, 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 that's how it goes, says the gingerbread man. There is no dragon in this story. Next, dragon climbs the hay where he meets a pig building a house out of sticks. Hello, can I be in your story? I got save you from that big bad wolf. No, 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 that's not how it goes, says the second yellow pig. There is no dragon in this story. So dragon sets off towards the town. On the way, he tries to help Goldilocks. No. And Hansel and Gretel. No, no. And Yeri Red Riding Hood. No. But nobody wants dragon in their story. Hmm. But hang on. Dragon has spotted a boy climbing a beanstalk. I could save you from the giant. No, no, no. That's not how it goes, says Jack. There is no dragon in this story. Fee, fi, fo, fum. I smell the blood of a dragon. Booms the giant. I've changed my mind. I don't want to be in this story. Boy, oh boy, what is happening here? Oh no. Did you see what was happening here? The feathers of this swan or duck went in the giant's nose. And then, ah, The sun is red. What's going to happen? It's out. Oops, it easy. The giant has blown out the sun. So now all the stories are dark and mixed up and confused. Let's see what the dragon can do now. Get off my hair. Ow, that's my nose. Has anyone seen my gas yipper? Move over. Give us a kiss. Dragon, where are you? Shouts the gingerbread man. What we need is a hero. But, whoopsie daisy, the dragon is a bit too scared. I can't. I'm not good at heroing. Now everyone is like, ah, hey, be a hero. But we really need a dragon in this story, says the gingerbread man. I can't. Can I? Can I? I can! This is the victory of the dragon. Now it's being brave. Wow! Now the dragon has decided to be a hero and now he's burning up the sun and lighting it up so everyone can see. Hurrah! A hero at last! Hooray! So, there you have it. A story about a brave dragon at last. <laughs> Who makes the giant sneeze? Oh no! Ah, too! Scream! And out goes.
was the sun. But I'm glad it made to the alley again. Yay! And it's a hero. Hurrah! The end. Hang on. Who is back and gone now? Oh, to another story. The, 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 the actual end. Oh, do you see his face? He can't eat the goats because the dragon is protecting them. Did you like the story? I loved it. So please, like and subscribe. Or else the dragon is going to be a vein again and gobble you up. Nom, nom, nom. So, till then, I'm Rahan, your storyteller, and I wish you a good night. I love this.